so to me, like, uh, what's his name? Uh, uh, Woody Allen said, I took to films, he says, because, you know, I, I was a very uh, uh, mediocre writer and I had to find some way half, you know, giving vent and expression to this urge in me to be a writer, you know. So I guess life was like that between school, college, and then later a few things that I did before descending into business and uh, wanting to strike out on your own and stuff like that. I decided that I didn't want to work with enough people out. There was too much to be said. It's like, you know, Neil Simon's uh, long goodbye, I think, Richard Dreyfuss playing. And he says, if you want to be on Broadway, you have to have a king-sized ego. So unfortunately, I suppose I had this king-sized misplaced ego. And somewhere I said, I can't work with any of these jokers and started a newspaper and got a couple of other people to come in. And then I moved to starting another newspaper, which got us down by 1989. I was down by some two lakhs or so, which is as good as two crores today. And so you see what, hap what happened is the tiger got me by the tail, you know, because you did something, you lost. So you have to do another thing in order to make it happen, in order to, you know, call it bits on one game. And then you got to something else. You were always having this search for a purpose, PCAP, uh, but you wanted to see how you could straddle that in a way that you could also uh, make a living without having to work for someone or the other. Uh, you always chafed under any uh, environment where you had to be told by somebody else to do something. And that's one you know, lovely <laughs> you know, luxury I had when I was a journalist of not being told what you should be doing. And so I guess, you know, one thing led to another and uh, with purpose being central, I never committed something or the other in terms of uh, any uh, ism, you know, for me, whether it's the environment or whether it's something else, I'm, I'm, I'm not somebody who is a, a freak on those things. But for me, it was an instrument that I could use in a way that I could blend also making a living.